What's up, y'all? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> like, you? oh, what she about to say? <laughs> I'm immediately more comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> with your character, Rachel, with yeah. Rosie, she wrote so many iconic skits for Saturday Night Live, but for all three of y'all in the process of, you know, researching this film, what is one of the sketch sketches? What is one of the <laughs> sketches that you ran across that you're like, oh, I think that's my new favorite sketch? Ooh. I loved the home invasion sketch, uh, which is in the first episode, that, and I had never seen before. Um, and that was sort of like my first thing that I saw. It was like my audition scene and like my first time trying out my character, and I loved that sketch. I had never seen it. I think the hard hot sketch for me, I was oh, like, yeah. this is so... I feel like also you can really trace back comedy always where you're like, this became this and then that and then that. And it feels like the beginning of, like, I think the women on the show, like, really were at the forefront of, like, women in comedy. And you can see it, down, like, we were talking before, like, I grew up watching, like, Kristen Wiig and Amy Poehler, Tina Fey, Maya Rudolph. But, like, that began um, in the first season. Which it's is not necessarily a sketch, but when Lily Tomlin hosted in the first episode, she has this monologue. It's like a one-woman play where she's playing this teenager in love at the school dance talking to her best friend and it's like so funny but also really like emotional and moving as this character and I and she's just showcasing herself as a performer and I would love to see that um, more integrated in maybe today's episodes because that was as they were finding the format of the show and it seems like no one had any bad ideas and they were just throwing that in there as an extra thing. I know that all three of these people that you all are portraying, they're all still here, unlike some of the other characters yeah. um, or some of the other people that are portraying folks in the, the film. Did you have an opportunity to connect with any of them and did they give, what was the best advice they gave you for dumping into this world? Because it's so freaking iconic. Well, I got to talk to Rosie, mm -hmm. which was amazing. We talked on the phone and I'm really excited to meet her in person. I think just like hearing her her voice and like the way she talked about like going into this and and it was like she's just so like the eye of the storm in this world like I feel like it's like everyone's freaking out she's cool she's smart and like I, I that was so helpful for me like a way into the character where I was like everyone's freaking out around you and like someone throws something at you you pivot or you move and that was yeah, it was super. It was super cool to talk to her. Um, Jason was like really funny in particular about me, like not maybe, mm -hmm. but like he like kind of in a way that Dan is like sort of I guess supposed to float like through all of mm -hmm. this chaos and be so kind of unaffected by it, and um, like he's like a. He's like a visiting creature from another planet. You know what I mean? <laughs> I would say you navigated Unfazed. that very well. Oh, sorry, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, You're what? hilarious. How about you, my dear? Yeah. Lauren was very lovely and totally gave us his blessing to do this film. Uh, but Jason thought it was best that I just focus on who he was as a young man and that I shouldn't uh, intake any other energy or information other than that first opening night in the first year of its creation and that's just what I focused on. I think you all did a fantastic job. I've seen the film. I reviewed it for um, a trade which we won't mention here but mm. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the film. I enjoyed your performances and the energy that y'all had to have to pull it off was awe-inspiring. So thank you for that thank you. and thank you thank for you. giving me your time today. I appreciate thank it. You. Thank you so much. Thank you very much.